Hi, I'm Sharon Bond, owner of Dame Mass Dance, a virtual studio located in Thunder Bay, Ontario, Canada. And today we will be doing one of my favorite moves in Kizomba, the Lady Saida. So the Lady Saida is one of the fundamental moves that you'd find in Kizomba. The word Saida means exit in Portuguese. And so in this move, the follow exits out of the line of dance. And so I'll turn around so you can see what I mean. So I'm in the line of dance. And when I'm going to do a Lady Saida, I'm going to step back one, then step out two. So that's exiting the line of dance. I'm gonna take my right and cross over my left, three. I'm gonna take my left and cross back into the line of dance, four, tap, five. So the Lady Saida, or maybe more politically correct, the follow Saida, is um, five counts. Now, Kizomba is an eight count dance. While it's not necessary to do moves that complete eight counts, when you are just starting off, sometimes it's easier for you to dance Kizomba by doing moves that complete eight counts. So I'm going to turn around and show you one way that you can complete the eight count with the Lady Saida, and that is by adding a basic three. So one, two, three, four, tap, five. Now here's the basic three, six, seven, tap, eight. Another way that you can complete the eight count with a Lady Saida is to do a contra tempo turn. And I have another video that I describe all sorts of different turns that you can do in Kizomba. So turn around. And so you do the Lady Saida. One, two, three, four. Then we're going to start turning to the left. Five and six, seven, tap, eight. Another variation that you can do with the Lady Saida. One, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, and eight. So that was a contra tempo step to the right and left, adding a bunda rotation. You can also play with um, the steps while you're doing the actual Lady Saida. So I can introduce a contra tempo step here. One, two, three, and four, tap five. So from the side, one, two, three, and four, tap five. So this is something, if you're trying to do a little bit of styling while your partner dancing, you can do without disturbing your partner. And just add a little flavor, a different uh, a change to the Lady Saida. You can also play with the tempo, but this is something that if you're dancing a partner dance, you would have to have your lead uh, lead you into doing this. If you're dancing by yourself, well, anything goes, right? <laughs> so, but let me turn around to, so you know what I mean. Two, one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, for example. So let's put some of those moves to music. Okay, I'm going to show you the different variations of, key, of the uh, Lady Saida that we did today. So I'll turn around. <laughs> tutorial on the Lady Saida. Uh, you can go to our website at damimassdance.ca to look at the courses that we offer. You can also follow us on Facebook at Demi Mass Dance Studio and on Instagram at Demi Mass Dance. Thanks for watching.